What is up peeps, it's your boy Veer here, busted out the Christmas sweater and we're gonna do some horse racing at the Los Alamitos core, race course. It's like pretty cold and windy kind of like out here in La Salle and I haven't done this horse racing thing before. This is my first time. I heard it's free. I got 20 bucks with me. I'm gonna start betting. It's either I win or I lose. So let's try this thing out. Yeah. Right, I got like $17 worth of vouchers and I'm probably gonna make some bets. All right, I placed in my bets, and I can either win or lose. But this place is kind of dead. Next race gonna start. So our first her horse lost the first round and we're gonna go do the second round next. It's gonna be, I'm betting on horse number five. One dollar on horse number five. Third race, one, number one, and third race, three. Fourth race is three. All right, the second round is about to start. Alrighty, it's post time. They're about lined up and the race is about to begin. Yeah. The race has begun. I bet it on five just cause. I don't know who's gonna win. In fact, I bet at one dollar. Yeah. Get inside! Get inside! Who's in front? Number two, one. Okay, third race is starting. I don't know who's gonna win. Hit it, six! So I think it's around like 7 o'clock and I only have like $13 left. This is like the fifth race. We're on the race, fifth race right now. And I haven't won yet. Looks like they have a little setup. It's going to start right in front of our eyes. Fifth race, fifth race. This is the final race of the horse race. Of the year. Of the year. Anything, anything else I need to say? Okay, final horse race of the year. What? I'm back from horse racing. I lost like 10 bucks. 
cashed in my other 10, got 10 bucks, ate at Olive Garden, mmm, so delicious, and now I'm back home, and I cannot believe 2020 is around the corner. It's like two weeks away. Well, we came this far from 2019. It's crazy. It's super insane. So, like, I was meaning to do a vlog on this, but I never had a chance to do it. But I became an Uber driver at about four months ago. It's pretty sweet. Yeah, it's like windy, like, right outside my house. And it's kind of sketch because the doors are like rumbling and I'm like all home alone. So anyway, I do both Uber and Lyft. And this is my car. Yeah, I drive this bad boy around because it meets the requirements and it has extra leg room. Can't see it because it's dark, but... It has good leg room. I even have the hookup. Mints on the side. Couple waters. Signs. There's Jolly Ranchers in the back. Extra spacious. And this thing is fuel efficient. I got this car like four months ago. I decided I wanted it to like, you know, be an Uber driver, like where I got my own schedule, my own time get paid a lot higher than the minimum wage. And it's working out pretty great. I think I've done like almost, done like over 200 rides combined on both Uber and Lyft. And before I did Uber and Lyft, I used to do delivery services such as Postmates and DoorDash. I did it for a little while until I finally became an Uber driver. Driving with both Uber and Lyft is a big money pot. It's where the money's at. And I can make pretty good money in one hour. It's honestly insane. It's probably the perfect job for me. I kept this baby cleaned like at least every week, both inside and out. Oh my god, it's crazy windy outside, and this thing just keeps on opening. I'm gonna find the weight and just put it there. Alright, so I'm done with Uber for the day, I'm all packed up, and I'm gonna go straight to my trip. Cannot believe 2019 just ended. I remember the beginning of 2019 from the back of my head. Wow, time really does fly. And now I'm gonna jump time zones and be in 2020. So, see ya, BGT Nation. Peace.